There is no doubt that this is certainly the most comprehensive report ever written with an incredible amount of detail. But at the same time, we should recognize that the basic message is the same as what the scientific community has been saying for more than 30 years. Biodiversity is important in its own right. Biodiversity is important for human well-being, and we humans are destroying it. So if you think of somebody having a really serious disease, which would be the symptoms which is most critical? Which of the analyses from, from the lab will be the most worrying? Actually, none on its own. All the analyses together compose a picture, and the, the, the whole picture, the whole consistent picture, the way they interact with others is the bad news or the good news. Importantly, we have done a lot already. There's enough instruments, international agreements, local policies, local efforts that if more, more boldly deployed and other bold change decisions are made, those pathways to achieve the sustainable development goals uh, are possible. The knowledge is there. We need to move to more bold implementation. Really, what we would like at the end of this report is to really give uh, the world a real message of hope. We don't want that people feel discouraged, that uh, there is nothing that can be done, that we've lost the battle because we have not lost the battle. And if given a chance, nature will reconquer its rights and will prevail. And so we really want everyone to feel that they can contribute, that they are part uh, of the solution. And this is very much the main message uh, that this uh, report is um, bringing to the world. You know, and then there are lots of, of species, individual species and habitats that are, that are suffering so significantly that they'll go to extinction. Extinction is permanent, right? So at, at various scales, there are all kinds of irreversibly. In terms of collectively, societally, that's too hard to say, you know? It seems, like, it seems quite clear that we're not there yet, that we still do have time, but we don't have time to dither around. It's time to get started.